Supermarkets are places where you can get your fresh produce, meat, and other types of food. Most people see supermarkets as a place that simply supplies your grocery needs and food for our next meals. In reality, the supermarket is a business, and just like any other businesses, they need to make money and profits at the end of the day. So while you might naively think supermarkets are there to supply people with food, just know that they're also designed to take as much as your money as possible. They have tricky ways to get you to spend more money than you need to. In this video, we will expose some of the most common ways supermarkets try to empty out your wallet. Make sure to stick around to the end of the video so you know how to avoid spending more than you need to the next time that you go shopping at the supermarket. Number 1. The essentials are almost always at the back of the store. Ever realize that in order to grab the essential groceries such as chicken, meat, milk, bread, and eggs, you have to walk all the way to the back of the supermarket? That is because supermarkets purposely place all the essential groceries in the back of the supermarket for a reason. Owners often place produce sections at the entrance of their supermarkets, and most supermarkets have the perishables around the perimeter, and the dry goods and household items on the shelves in the center of the store. Supermarket is a very treacherous environment if you're trying to eat well or eat healthily. Very sophisticated landscape that's been designed to extract as many dollars from your wallet as possible. Ever notice that most of the aisles in the front are the ones that have junk food, such as chips, cookies, and sodas? Well, the trick is to get you to pass through the no man's land and get tempted to add things to your cart on the way to the back. Best way to not get lured is to walk straight through with tunnel vision. Number two. Pricier things tend to be the same height as you. Things at the eye level or the middle of the row for the average height of an adult 5 feet or plus are usually more expensive. Supermarkets know that people's attention span isn't all that long and they tend to look at items that are the closest to their line of sight, which will most likely be the things in the middle row. Most people really make the effort to kneel down to look at the bottom shelves or climb up a ladder and try looking at things on the top row, especially for those who are just looking to grab and go quickly. Next time, try checking the lower shelves and see if the price tags are cheaper. Leave your findings in the comment box below. Number 3. Supermarket Music There is elevator music and then there is supermarket music. The thing they have in common is, it's always soft soothing type of music. No, it's not because the employee randomly chose it. All this is done for a reason. The music is played to psychologically make the shopper feel relaxed in a calm state of mind while shopping. The music is designed to slow your pace and make you stay in the store longer, rolling through the aisles and filling up your cart, thus spending more of your money. Number 4. Rewards Cards It is true that some reward cards do come with perks such as discounted prices, but the real catch is to lure you with the reward cards that allow you to earn points. Market owners give much thought to how to get people into their stores and encourage them to become loyal customers. Supermarkets typically use to convince customers they're getting the most out of their food dollar. The point system allows you to collect rewards when you reach a certain amount, but it's been shown that people tend to shop more things they might not necessarily need, all just to try to stock up more reward points to earn their incentive. The best thing to do is take advantage of the discounts it offers, but only buy what you need. Number 5. Last Minute Impulse Shop at the Register Ever notice how the register area looks so cluttered with items like chocolate, candy, magazines, and sodas? On face value, you might think they are just running out of space to stock these items, but in reality, it's put there as bait, and you are the fish is trying to reel in for a buy. Experts have said about two-thirds of what we buy in the supermarket, we have really no intention of buying, and they say supermarkets, they know this, and they rely on it, and even encourage it. Supermarkets understand that lines at the register could be so long, that while you are waiting to pay, you might see chocolate and suddenly get a crave. Or you might see your gossip talk on your favorite celebrity on the magazine or remember you needed gum for your hot date after. This is designed to make you make a last minute impulse buy, which means more money for the supermarket. Don't take the bait. Since we're at the end of this video, let us try to lure you in with some good supermarket deals at the end caps. How about this smart food white cheddar popcorn to munch on while binge watching on Genius Tomato YouTube videos? Watch it down with the sparkling water. Consider signing up for Amazon Fresh to have your groceries delivered to you. Links will be in the description box below. Let's see if you take the bait. Until the next video, stay informed and Genius Tomato out.